Alright guys, Jada Miner here. Thought I'd give you guys a quick tour of the crypto mining basement. Just wanted to give you guys a quick tour, show you how things are set up, show you my setup, show you what I'm running, show you where you can get a couple of the things that I'm running at. Um, Alright, so I'll leave, leave a link in the description below to a few of the things that I show here in the video. Uh, to Some of the things may be in stock, some of them may not be, but I'll leave a link to some of the things that I describe here in it. Maybe not everything, but some of the stuff that I'm using here for my setup. So if you are inquiring about it or maybe you want to try to get you something that I'm using, you definitely can. All right, we'll start off with the EVGA for the win 33080 rig right here. I'm running six cards, six 3080s here. Five of them are EVGA for the win three edition cards. The last one over here is uh, Asus ROG Strix. 3080 so it's a 6 by 3080 rig total for the motherboard i'm using the asus prime z 390p motherboard and this is the four inch touchscreen um, from amazon for the red for the raspberry pies i use these for all my rigs just so i can monitor them keep a good eye on them and see what kind of you know hash rate they're getting even though i could use the gui i like you know having it on the rig just so i can observe them all right, and if I ever need to do anything to them, right away I plug right into the motherboard. There I go. Um, on this rig, I'm running two 1300 watt EVGA gold power supplies on this one. Up here, I'm running a 6x3060 Ti rig. Five of these are EVGA for the win three. One of them is a 3060 Ti XC. Um, we over here we've got a 1050 Cougar power supply and also a 1200 EVGA gold power supply uh, as well on this 3060 Ti rig. Also got the Raspberry Pi touchscreen as well. Over here I've got my PDU um, that I'm using to run all my power supplies on. I've also got another PDU up here on the top rack. I got my network switch up here so I can run all my rigs and make sure they're all hooked up via Ethernet. I do not like using Wi-Fi just a much more reliable connection um, using ethernet on each of these 3080s i'm getting roughly about 98 mega hash each on each of these 3060 ti's i am actually getting about 60 mega hash each on this one i'm actually using a older motherboard on this one this one is a biostar uh, t185 motherboard and it does have also an intel cpu on this one, I'm also using an Intel CPU. Um, on this one, it's the Celeron LG uh, 4490 on that one here. Um, off the wall, I did uh, make these meters myself. Or I didn't make the meters, I'm sorry. I made the plugs myself. The meters are ordered off of Amazon. I'll have a link to those below. Um, they're some similar to what Space Ghost uses, uses. They're the exact same meters. I just converted them into a different plug. Um, those are my PDUs. I've got three 30 amps and then one 120 on the bottom um, for the stuff I need to run for the 120. All right, all, over here I've got all the GPUs that I am going to be using for future builds that I'm gonna bring you guys. Um, all the GPUs here. If you're wondering where I sourced almost 30 GPUs at, I did get them all off of eBay and I did overpay for them. I paid two double to two and a half times MSRP for each of the cards that you see there. For the 3060 Ti's, roughly about 1200. Uh, for the 3070's, 1314-ish. Uh, um, for the 3080's, two to 2200. Um, for the 3090's, they were 3000-ish uh, each. Um, so I have yet to utilize that B250 mining export motherboard there. That one I'm gonna utilize on the next build there. I've got a couple of uh, processors that we're gonna use for future builds. All this stuff I will bring to you on future builds. We are gonna build every single graphic card you see here will be used in a build. All right, down there we've got the Mindbox 12 as well. We've got a bunch of extra fans. I'm a fan of the Noctua fans, but I'm a bigger fan of the Wathi fans. I've got about 30 of those over there. I'm probably gonna be using those primarily in most of the builds. Down here, we've got all the uh, extra components that we need. We've got thermal pads. We've got extra uh, uh, power splitters. We've got fan splitters. Everything that we would need for our builds. Uh, so over here, we're going to be utilizing this bigger rack. We're going to put all the rigs over here eventually. As I said, this setup is just temporary. Um, we've got six more EVGA. Um, 1200 watt gold power supplies in there. We've got 30 other Wathi fans in there. We've got uh, two 1200 watt 
uh, platinum HP server power supplies and two 1600 watt platinum HP power supplies in there. We're going to be utilizing those with the breakout boards over there in a future build. Uh, we've also got the order of GPU risers in there. Those I'm actually anxious to use. We're going to be utilizing those on the next build. Here down here, we've got the 12 GPU frame that we are in the process of building. Um, we are going to get that one ready. That will be up and we will get the GPUs and get that whole frame um, up and get the whole rig built tonight for sure. Absolutely. We're going to get it all. Now that we've got enough power, we're going to build, build, build. All right. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick tour of the crypto mining basement. Let you guys see what, what I got going on. Check out my setup and just to give you guys a quick tour all right my name is jay minor sorry about the focus issue all right my name is jay minor hit that like button hit that subscribe button just wanted to like i said just give you guys a quick setup a uh, quick tour of the temporary setup so far we are going to move some stuff around we are going to get it looking a lot better we are going to get more rigs built so hit that like button hit that subscribe button and i'll see you guys on the next one